Hello and welcome to the channel. This is Meredith and as promised, here I am right at the nth hour coming through with a full spoiler video for you. Um, the reason why I wanted to jump on here is that I don't have a community tab so I couldn't tell you there are a couple of new options. Um, I'm going to just try to speed through this. Um, if you are new to the channel, I do have plenty of other spoiler videos including some in-depth sort of looks at all of the different customization options that were announced at that time. Um, so definitely look back for those. Um, and then I also have other unboxings and things like that on the channel. I do have a link below. It'll get you $10 off your first box. It might not work though because I did cancel my subscription to FabFitFun this season. Um, I wanted to skip but they wouldn't let me skip. So anyway, that's a long story. So if you if it doesn't work or you find a better coupon, definitely use that. Um, I also have a link below from Rakuten. I'm not sponsored by any of these companies, by the way. Um, the Rakuten link is just a personal referral link. It'll get you some additional cash back on top of the cash back for FabFitFund if you do sign up for a Rakuten account using that link. Um, I do get a small, um, I think, rebate, I guess, for referring someone, but that's uh, that's everything. I'm not sponsored. Okay, so I'm going to jump in here. So let me just get started. If you do have any experience with any of the products or have any additional information that might be helpful, leave a comment below because that is always great to read myself. Um, so here we go. This is the first customization, and this one actually does have a new item that they just added, I think today, actually. Um, I will be trying to do a boost my box spoiler video after this, but we'll see because I'm kind of running out of time because um, I do have a little bit of extra work to do for my day job. Um, so this is the spoiler alert for number one. So the first spoiler here is from Fenty Beauty. It's the Gloss Bomb Heat Universal Lip Luminizer and Plumper Bundle in Hot Cherry and Lemon Lava. It's a must-have lip luminizer and plumper set that delivers a hint of tint and fuller looking lips. Um, so the is a set of two. This one is the Hot Cherry and this is Lemon Lava and I think the Lemon Lava is new um, but again if you have any comments about this particular product leave a comment below. I do know a lot of influencers thought that this was a really great product for 2021 just throwing that out there. The next product is also from Fenty Beauty. This is the Diamond Bomb All Over Diamond Veil in Royal Icing. Um, so I do have more information about what the shade description is and things like that on my other video. It's a one-of-a-kind diamond dusted highlighter that applies like a 3D glittering veil and delivers show-stopping sparkle. Oh, it does have a large mirror. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. Um, this is from Fenty Beauty as well. This is the Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter in Girl Next Door slash Chic Freak. Light up where you want, when you want, with this weightless longwear cream powder hybrid highlighter duo. So it is a duo here. Um, leave a comment below if you have used the highlighter formula, because um, I'm actually kind of interested in knowing what the cream powder seems like. The next item here is from L Space. So this is a brand that was featured in previous boxes, but this is a new product for the brand within the box, if that makes sense. Um, they have had plenty of coolers in FabFitFun in the past. This is a high quality cooler featuring an insulated lining, front pocket detail, color blocking strap, and zipper closure. Um, so something I just noticed is that there's actually two zippers so you can kind of like move it around and things like that. I think that's kind of neat. And then it looks like the um, actual zipper, I, mentioned this in my other video as well, is slightly lower um, so it won't just be a zip up at the top and reach your hand in. you can kind of flip top. Um, I don't know if that's the case but that's what it looks like to me at least. The next item here is from Morgan Lane. So I did try my hardest to find additional measurements and I just couldn't do it. Um, they, they didn't have measurements anywhere except for that one that I found on my other video. Um, so a couple of comments here is that I will play you a video shortly. I hope it will play without the music because I think it is copyrighted. Um, but this one is um, somewhat short actually even though they say it's a long silky robe in romantic spring tones is both elegant and classic making it the perfect addition to your closet. They do say it comes in small, medium, large, extra large, and plus. Um, but I did read comments online and also on the spoiler that I'm going to show you um, that this particular brand isn't known for making plus size items so again I don't know anything about the measurements and if you have any information about that leave a comment below and I'll pin your comment because that's very helpful. Um, I did find measurements on my previous video as I mentioned but they didn't have units. It does seem like it's probably in centimeters obviously because some of the measurements were like 70 but I don't know that for sure. So let me play you that video here. Um, so they did, ha did have it here. So again, this isn't super helpful because she looks like she's probably like a medium and she's about five foot seven, maybe six, 
slash eight in US sizes, I'm guessing. So it does have pockets and it does have a ribbon closure, but it is pretty short in my opinion. It looks about mid thigh on her and she's not exactly tall, um, in my opinion at least. So that is the information I have for you. It does look like it has long sleeves though, um, pretty long sleeves at least. So let me keep going. The other weird thing I have to mention, just sorry that I'm going so hard on this, um, but this particular video had like a black woman as the model as the thumbnail, but when you open it, this woman is definitely not black. Anyway, let me just keep going here. Um, so this is Caravan Home. It's the Lazy Susan in wood. It says, this Arcacia wood Lazy Susan is great for serving up snacks or as a decorative piece that will bring together any space. So it is a Lazy Susan and it does rotate on the bottom. Um, I do have photos of my previous video of what the bottom looks like. And this is the Christoph Robin Regenerating Mask with Prickly Pear Oil, Rejuvenate Dry, Damaged, and Chemically Treated Hair so it looks healthy and restored. And this one is from Alice and Olivia. This was in a previous box. Everybody had really great things to say about these two products. Um, this one is the Daisy Print Duffel Bag and Bucket Hat. It's a printed duffel bag and reversible bucket hat. Make the perfect pair for all your spring adventures. So that bucket hat is reversible, the other side is white. And then um, this is what the last one was at time of printing. However, they did just release another spoiler. Um, so this one was released today. Um, so this is, again, for customization one. So this is the One Size Patrick Star Visionary Eyeshadow Palette, a $42 value. Um, so Patrick Star is a beauty influencer on YouTube. I've never watched his videos um, or anything like that. I don't know anything about Patrick Star, to be completely honest. Um, but I do know that One Size was released either last year or the year before. Um, but this is the info here. So it's a curated palette of Patrick Star's favorite faves or sorry, Forever Faves, featuring everyday matte and pigmented shimmer shades. This eyeshadow palette includes yummy neutrals and bold pops of color for endless makeup play. Um, so the size is zero, uh, 15 by 1.5 grams, or 15 by, oh, okay, 15 is the number of shades, got it, uh, 0 0.5 ounces. Um, so there is some info here, and this is the ingredients list for you. And I'm gonna scroll down a little bit. There is a lot of info in here so i'm gonna try to go slowly definitely pause the video if you want more info and this particular item is not available for uk members so let me open up so i did a little bit of research so you can see here that um, i went to both patrick star's website and also sephora um, i was trying to get sephora's um reviews because it looks like it's like a 3.5 star rating with 123 reviews but it looks like it's only in canadian so it must only be on Canada. So I wasn't able to see it because when I clicked on that, it says there is not product carried, no product carried. Um, so I had to go to the um, official website. So it is on sales for half off for $21 right now. If you are interested in picking it up, oops, I don't want to play a video. And then let me scroll down here. Oh my gosh. Here are the shades. <laughs> and... I'm not entirely sure what these little um, insignia mean, but leave a comment below if you're a fan and you know. That is what it looks like swatched on different um, skin colors. Um, so let me just scroll down for some info. Cruelty free, sorry, cruelty free, paraben free, gluten free, and vegan. And then the reviews, 22 reviews and a 4.7 star rating on the official website. Again, the Canadian Sephora had a 3.5 star rating. Just thought I would throw that out there. Um, so it says, great. Palette is awesome. However, it is lightly pressed and therefore therefore prone to fallout. Highly pigmented, so use with caution in a light hand. Re makeup routine is minimal, so this palette will last a couple of years and I snatched for half off. Great deal all around. Um, somebody got it in BoxyCharm, so if you got it in BoxyCharm, leave a comment below. And then, let me see. Yeah, everybody has really great things to say. They got them in Ipsy too. So if you've received it in the past, leave a comment. So I'm going to move on to spoiler two. Sorry, this video is going to be long. There's a lot of options. Um, this is from Pharmacy. It's the Honey Halo Moisturizer. It's an intense moisturizer that replenishes dry skin with lasting hydration to help plump lines and for, uh, sorry, plump skin and improve fine lines. And then the next one here is Kate Spade. 
This is the Keaton pouch wristlet. Conveniently carry your essentials with ease in this gorgeous magenta wristlet pouch with a strap. So honestly, um, I have a few comments about this. So I like carrying Kate Spade bags, um, but mine are leather. So this is made from PVC, so that's plastic. Um, also, it seems a little bit strange because this doesn't look like the typical logo. I'm not um, it just looks like it's printed on. Um, so all of my previous bags that I've owned all have like a metal, I don't know, charm or something on it. I don't know how to describe it, um, but it's not embossed and it's not like a, a stamp, basically. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, they did say that this is pretty big, actually, when I did my other videos. So I don't remember the measurements offhand, but definitely grab a tape measure because they did say you can put your phone, your keys, your wallet, and like a snack in there. Um, so it sounded like huge, but I also eat large snacks and also have a large phone and a large wallet. So we'll see about that. So leave a comment below if you have any other comments about Kate Spade. Um, but I'm going to just move on. So this is from Caudalie. It's the Vino Pure Oil Control Moisturizer. This is a lightweight mattifying moisturizer that hydrates, absorbs excess oil, and reduces the appearance of imperfections. This one is from Bando. It's the stemless acrylic wine glass set of four with glitter infusion. It's a set of four glitter infused double walled acrylic tumbler cups that add a little sparkle to your fave drinks. Um, so that one is plastic as well. So I think it would be good if you're like have a pool or something um, just so you can have it at the pool side. The next is from Yoga Wake Up Inc. It's a three months audio guided yoga app subscription and acupressure pillow. The pillow gently applies pressure to many acupressure points in the back, neck, hands, and feet. Um, so honestly, I couldn't find any more information about this video. Sorry about this um, what's it called? A pillow um, than I could find in my previous video. Um, but it does seem like it's filled with buckwheat. So if you haven't had a buckwheat pillow, they're very firm. Um, just throwing that out there as well. Um, but I couldn't find any info or additional reviews or anything. Sorry about that. The next item is from Pericone MD. It's a high potency classics face finishing and firming moisturizer, two ounces. It's a rose scented moisturizer combines Pericone MD's signature sciences with a nourishing and ultra hydrating texture. The next item is from Splendid, and this one is a repeat as well. Um, the comments I've read about them are mixed. A lot of people like them and a lot of people don't like them. Um, so the positive ones say that it's really like fluffy and they're like warm without being too warm. And then the negative comments I've read just said that they are like, they get flat like very quickly and then they're not super comfortable. They're a little bit slippery or something like that. Um, I'm just summarizing what I've um, read. I don't have any experience with them myself. This is the faux fur slippers in crystal pink. These adorable faux fur slippers will keep your toes warm and offer premium cushioning with every step. Um, so there are two sizes, I believe, for this product. I think it was small, medium, and then large, extra large. So that is all the info I got for you. And then I'm going to jump on to the next spoiler. I am speeding along here. So the first item here is the Erin Condren Design Stationery Bundle. It's an assorted greeting card set that comes complete with 16 cards and envelopes along with a group of three dual tip markers. Um, so it looks like, again, the markers are gray, pink, and green, and there are definitely assorted cards here. Um, let me move on. Um, there's more information about this product in my sneak peek video if you want to take a look at that. The next item is from Kate Spade. These are mini small square studs in opal glitter. These gold plated flirty glitter studs are the perfect finishing touch to any spring look. Um, so the one thing I do want to say about this is that these are plastic as well. So just know that going into it. The next item is from Privé Rival, and it's the Juliet Black Sunglasses. Get ready to have some fun in the sun with these stunning cat eye shaped frames with flat metal accent. Um, so this photo doesn't look quite as vibrant here for the metal accent as the official photos on the website, so I don't know if that means they're a little bit different or not, um, but on the official website this looks more like um, gold toned. Um, just throwing that out there. Again, I don't know anything about if they're exactly the same. They do have the same name, but they look a little bit different. This is the Kate Somerville Exfoliate Intensive Pore Exfoliating Exfoliating treatment. It's an exfoliant, helps remove surface dullness, softens fine lines, and reveals a smoother, more glowing complexion. 
And this one is also a repeat. This is from Gaiam. It's the Ultimate Core Toning Kit. It's a versatile kit designed to target the tone, sorry, target and tone the core, build strength, burn calories, and improve flexibility. Um, so it does have this ball. I think it comes flattened and you have to pump it up. And then there's also this, I don't know what it is. I'm not in shape. Um, so I don't know how to describe this, but basically for Pilates is what my understanding is. Um, it does have some links and things, um, so I did show you where to find those links for the workouts um, on my previous video as well, um, but there is a workout guide and things included with it as well. And this is also a repeat. It's been a repeat for a couple of seasons now, actually. This is the Shoshana umbrella. It says, you'll be singing in the rain thanks to the compact daisy printed umbrella. So it does have ruffling details on the side, and it does look like it's a push to open, but I'm still not sure if it's pushed to close. So if you do have any experience with it, leave a comment below. And that is the final one for this customization. So customization four is here. And this one is the last one that you're able to customize as a seasonal member. Um, so the customizations five and six are going to be surprises for you. But for five and six, the annual members are able to customize. So this one is one of the hair products. So there are three variations of the this particular brand's um, products. So this one is the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product. Say goodbye to dull damaged hair and hello to the easy to use leave-in formula, formula that leaves hair invigorated. So there's also one here for, um, it has keratin in it as well. It says penetrates deep into the hair shaft to rebuild dry, brittle, and damaged hair from the inside out. And there is a third one and this one is the coily one. So it says give your coils the moisture they need while providing weightless styling control for healthy and shiny hair. Um, so I would say that definitely watch my other video if you're trying to choose between the three because there are some subtle differences and then the reviews are very different for them. Um, and this one is another home item. This is from Favor. It's the spoon rest and it is in the color gray. Um, so it is like a two-tone gray. One side looks a little bit more cream colored and the other is like um, kind of like a taupey gray. Um, it's the perfect accessory for your countertop for resting your go-to cooking utensils. So I was thinking about this and like if I got it, I have plenty of spoon rests. It might be nice for like underneath plants and things, but that's just me thinking. Um, the next one here is from Josie Marin or Marin, I don't know how to pronounce it. Whipped argan oil, body butter, and sweet citrus. Get ready to revitalize your skin while basking in the alluring smells of sweet citrus. And this one is another of the new items, so I will have the additional information up there for you um, shortly. This is the mantra band. It's the cuff bracelet and the color is silver. Let these words be your anchor and reminder that you have the strength and the will to do what it takes. Um, so that's the last one here, so let me pull it open. Um, I was only able to find it with reviews on their website. Um, I would say that you can buy it pretty inexpensively on some third-party, like, um, what's it called? Mercari or something like that. Um, so it says she believes she could, so she did. $25, and there are plenty of colors. See so if you are interested in buying it flat out. So it's fully adjustable, one size fits most. Um, stainless steel, lead-free, nickel-free, hypoallergenic, tarnish-resistant gold and rose gold bracelets are 14, no, it's like 18 gold, oh my gosh, gold and rose gold bracelets are 18 karat gold dipped. Authentic mantra band brand bracelet. Delicate but durable, our bracelets are made to last a lifetime. We offer a lifetime guarantee against breakage. Okay, so let me scroll down. To care for it, wipe with a soft cloth, avoid frequent contact with strong chemicals such as detergent, bleach, perfume, etc. Store in a um, jewelry box or a soft cloth and remove your gold bands before shower or exercise. Don't wear them in hot tubs or swimming pools. Um, I do think I remember reading this, so I think this might be a repeat item. So leave a comment below if you've tried it or if you remember if this is a repeat. It might have actually been in a different box now that I'm thinking about it. Um, but here are the reviews. So it has pretty high reviews. It looks like it's a completely five-star rating, but that's a little bit hard to believe because there is a three-star here. So this person said, oh, okay, it was about shipping. So that one is, anyway, 
I don't have any more information about this product, so let me move on. This is spoiler number five. So again, this is only for the annual numbers to customize. For seasonals, it'll be a surprise. This is the Jamelli Jana Clip 2-pack. Look trendy while securing your hair in place for hours with these perfect everyday clips. The Earth Harbor Glow Juice Refining Enzyme Mask. This is a powerful pair. Sorry, oh my gosh, my brain. A purple paradise. This powerful, fast acting AHA BHA gel mask naturally resurfaces, cools, and refirms skin. Sorry, and firms skin. The next one is Even Prime Hypernova Dark Circle Reducer Eye Serum. Look refreshed all season with this gel serum that reduces the look of dark circles, fine lines, and puffiness. Um, so it does look like it has a little bit of an applicator tip. I've never heard of this brand before this spoiler. And this one is also a repeat. This is from Sorbus. It's a makeup organizer. Categorize your makeup after spring cleaning and this mini organizer with daisy print detailing. And final item here, this is a customization six. Again, annual members are able to customize. And this one is the one with a bunch of different packs. So in the past, um, the seasonal members, we've been told that we only got three packs. But last season, I got a two pack. Just letting you know that. I don't actually know what the rules are anymore. Um, but just gonna throw that out there. Um, so this one, this particular one, I think I actually have all of the items um, in my possession. Except for, I think I have a different shade of the double act. Um, but this is the Ico double act shadow stick, and it's in the shades Cookies and Cream. Um, so it is an eyeshadow stick. The next is Winky Lux in the Stars Lip Oil. So this one has little star um, sprinkles. I don't even know what they are. Um, I did get this in my, my winter box. It's very, very scented like vanilla. It smells kind of like cream, like um, vanilla cream cake. Um, so it wasn't my particular flavor and there's also um glitter in it as well then also there is the daily concepts daily facial dry brush i do have this i've used it a couple of times not sure if i used it correctly but it was an extra step in my um in my face skincare routine the next is from london town it is the critical creme pen that one's here um, and then the Human and Kind Hand Scrub and Elder Flower and Raspberry. This is a repeat, and this one is a repeat as well. From Ico, it's the Double Act Eyeshadow Stick again. This one is a two-pack, so it's going to be the Erno Laszlo Sea Mud Deep Cleansing Bar. And then the Lark and Ives Hair Scarf Bundle. I think both of these have been in previous boxes before. I'm not sure about the cleansing bar, but I know that the, clen the clay mask has been because I hated that product when I got it. It made me break out so bad. Um, but this particular product has definitely been in sales before. Um, the Winky Lux In The Stars Lip Oil and the London Town Cuticle Creme Pen. Um, so again, I got this last season, but it wasn't in one of the spoilers, um, but I did get it in my box. So it must have been a supply chain thing, because I think that also last season they were experimenting with the Surprise Me thing. It could have been anything in their warehouse, um, but I do remember and know I got this because I, I just put it into my um, storage. And this one is one of the choose ones. So these are like a higher price item. Um, so I did promise that I would open the Teddy Girl eyeshadow palette from Butter London because I only opened the Teddy Boy one. I didn't realize that until it was too late. And then this one is from Hourglass. It's the Ambient Strobe Lighting Blush in Incandescent Electra. So somebody commented, thank you for that, um, that you can actually buy this at Ulta. I just searched on... Um, Sephora and I couldn't find the shade, I looked on Nordstrom and I couldn't find the shade, I looked on Bloomies and I couldn't find the shade, so I kind of gave up at that point. Um, but it is available at Ulta, apparently. And then finally, this is from Coach, it's the Open Circle Necklace and Tea Rose Stud Set. So this, it has like Coach written around the, um, the pendant thing. So let me see, okay. Also, the new Co Topical C. I did get this in my Allure Beauty box in the past. Mine was a little bit bigger of a bo bottle, if I'm being honest. Um, this one looks pretty small. Um, I, I'm not a huge fan of it myself. I did declutter it, and it will be in a future empties video slash decluttering video, just because it didn't fit my lifestyle in particular. Um, and then this here is the Millie Jewelry Case, and this one is a repeat as well. And um, I think it was in last spring's box. And that is the final item here in the customization six. So let me just open that info for you about the Butter London. Where did it go? I had it open. Okay, hold on one second. Teddy girl. 
Sorry, you have to watch me search. It was open. So this is the Teddy Girl palette and it's $28. Um, but these are the shades here. So it does look like a mix of shimmer and mattes. And these are the swatches on different skin colors. It does look like it has a little bit of a mirror here, not super big. It's a nine piece. It combines the defiant edge of Butter London and the rebellious Brit speed. Oh my gosh, and the rebellious spirit of Britain's Teddy Girls. Um, I don't know what that is, so leave a comment below if you know what that is. Um, this highly pigmented nine-piece shadow palette revives the 1950s to pay homage to the alluring, sharply suited Teddy Girls, the original Cool Girls, and the rebellious fashionista spirit. Play by your own rules with buildable, wearable hues with intense color payoff in the mix of cheeky matte duochrome shimmer and metallic finishes to get you ready for days and nights of defiance. Gives you larger shadows of your few of your soon-to-be favorite shades to pair with smaller, bold accent colors for trailblazing trail eye makeup looks that are as bold or as muted as you want them to be. Easy to carry mirrored compact makes for easy touch-ups and endless day-to-night makeups, sorry, day or night make makeup looks with a touch of rebel glam. Um, so it looks like there's Beatrice, which is a matte warm brown, poppy matte pale nude, Ella copper dual chrome metallic pippa matte pale peach, Matilda matte burnt orange, Lucille rose gold shimmer, Lottie cranberry metallic, Iris pink peach dual chrome metallic, and Penelope a matte spiced wine. Cruelty free, paraben free, gluten free. So there are 27 reviews and it looks like a five star rating. People say that it's pretty good. So that is the review there. Um, so also, let me just show you, like when I clicked on it, I thought for sure I was going to see this person. Like they, they clickbaited me <laughs> because when I clicked on it, she wasn't there. Um, but yeah, anyway, that was everything I got for you for the full spoilers. Again, I'm going to try to do the boost my box thing right after this by thing. I mean spoilers, but we'll see because I, again, I have some work to do for my real job. Um, so leave a comment below. Let me know what you're going to get because um, maybe I'll have FOMO. Yeah, I'll probably have FOMO. So yeah, thank you again for watching and I hope to see you again soon. I do have quite a few other videos that are going to be coming out. I did catch up on my um, Allure Beauty Box this week, which was crazy good for me at least because I was a little bit hanging over my head. But yeah, I will talk to you again soon. Bye.